today to share with you all this wig I'm wearing by Altre to make sure that I have its name and its specs and everything else correctly about it I'm gonna read it to you from its packaging so I'm rocking the Altre quick weave complete cap made with deep parting she's curl iron safe she's flat iron safe up to 400 degrees the style name is called Marie and the color you're seeing is 1B this is what it's going to look like that is the model that is on the packaging and this is Miss Marie. When you get her out of the packaging, literally, and when I say literally, I mean literally. Why? Because there is no lace to cut. This is part of Outre's quick weave style series. And with the quick weaves, there's no lace to cut. You get it out the packaging, you put it on your head and you can go. I only did a little bit of manipulation to this wig. And what I mean by manipulation is on the parting space. I added my face powder on the parting space just to brighten it up, just to make the parting space appear more visible. Aside from that, that is all I did to this wig. I didn't need to do any manipulation on the parting space. What you see is exactly what you're going to get. I didn't have to tweeze this. I didn't have to pluck it. I didn't have to pull it. I didn't have to do anything to get the width or the length that you are seeing. What you're seeing is exactly what you're going to get. The only thing I did, like I said, was add my face powder in on a parting space just to brighten it up to appear more visible. But this is Miss Marie, and I'm loving the shaggy, you know, like messy bob look. Yeah, Marie is serving all that for me. And I appreciated the fact that I didn't have to concern myself with cutting the lace, which to me would make this a fantastic beginner friendly wig. Because if you're new to wearing wigs, especially lace wigs, and you're not too comfortable with cutting the lace yourself thinking you might damage the wig, the Outre quick weave lines would be right up your alley. I kid you not. So let me tell you about the texture. The texture of the hair is definitely on the bundled hair end, meaning it feels kind of like some Brazilian-ish kind of uh, feel. It's not a yakky texture. It definitely have some type of Remy or um, Indian type texture to it. But then again, it's definitely not yakky. You're not getting a yakky feel with this texture. It feels more so like some kind of bundled hair. Maybe along the line of Brazilian hair a little bit, but it definitely feels like bundled hair. And to me, it even moves like bundled hair. So let me give you a fair chance to see what the front, the back, and the side is looking like. This is what she's looking like from the front. Miss Marie. This is her from the side. This is her from the back. Loving how, like I said, the messy bob look. That's the back. The side. And this is the front. And this is Miss Marie. And I'm absolutely loving this wig. Hence the reason why I decided to upload this video so you can love this wig too. So on that note, dolls, this pretty much just concluded the video. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. And if you haven't yet subscribed to the Miss Glamour at a YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button and join in on an amazing official glam doll community they call me miss glamour addict i'm all about being a beauty on a budget who loves not breaking bank for a fab look exactly like what i just showed you in this video because this wig is insanely affordable seriously this did conclude the video thanks again for taking the time to watch this video don't forget we still got to stay sociably connected so please keep in mind i am on facebook i'm on instagram and i'm on twitter with more beauty alerts and fab beauty on a budget finds and i will see you all in another video again shortly later dog. Oh,